Hey, Dan Kalish here. I want to talk to you today a little bit about the adrenal stress test. And I have been ordering these labs for 20, 25 years. I find them to be one of the most helpful health assessments that someone can do. So simple and yet so profound. So I go through, I'm going to go through a couple of examples, just kind of tell you what the test is about and why I think it's so important. So stress in the clinical model that I have, you know, understanding what makes us sick, you know, most people become compromised in terms of their health because of stress. What kinds of stress? Emotional stress, dietary stress, pain or inflammation. Something is stressing your system. And this hormone called cortisol responds to stress. And so when we do an assessment for any health condition, whether you're depressed or tired or, you know, you have some kind of chronic infection, whatever it might be, we want to assess cortisol levels and make sure that we normalize them. So I'm just going to show you a few examples of the test. It's relatively easy to do. It's done from saliva samples. So you spit into a tube four times during the day, and they map out your cortisol levels, morning, noon, afternoon, and night. And you can see this particular person had a high nighttime cortisol, and that's very strongly associated with problems uh, with sleep. Okay, because we're also measuring your diurnal rhythm or your circadian rhythm here as we measure the cortisol. And then, of course, you also include DHEA on these labs as well. So here's another example of a test. Each one of these is like a fingerprint, right? That's unique to the person. So this particular person had a huge drop in cortisol at the noon hour where they are really exhausted and then got kind of amped up and wired in the afternoon and evening. So a big crash followed by a surge. Again, each one of these tests is slightly different. You see different patterns in different people. Here's one more example of someone who's super exhausted in the morning and then skyrockets up in the afternoon and crashes. And so when we see what the pattern of cortisol production is, I can then recommend a specific program to fix this. So for example, with this person, we would bring up the low cortisol earlier in the day and bring down that high level in the afternoon using supplements like phosphatidylserine and licorice root extract and pregnenolone and using blood sugar support and diets, et cetera. The other way that you help control the stress, obviously, is with lifestyle changes, right? So like what you're eating, what you're, how you're exercising, how much sleep you're getting, when you're going to sleep, how much meditation or relaxation you're doing every day, relaxation exercises, breathing exercises, meditation, things like that. So when we do the adrenal assessment, it opens up a window for me to be able to design a supplement program to fix the hormone imbalances that are happening in terms of your stress hormones and start to fine tune the lifestyle changes. So we get the diet, exercise, sleep, and meditation parts of all this figured out. Really important test. One of the key, uh, key ways that we really do an assessment as to how to start improving your health. So if you have questions about the lab, please contact the office. Be happy to answer any of them. Thanks.